Here we're asked to simplify a rational expression. We begin by factoring the numerator and denominator. In this case, we have a trinomial in the numerator, 2x squared factors 2x times x. 15 factors 3 times 5. In fact, let's use plus 3 times x minus 5. Positive 3 times negative 5 is negative 15 and negative 10x plus 3x is negative 7x. This is factored correctly. Now in the denominator I notice difference of two squares. This factors 5 plus x times 5 minus x. Once we have the denominator factored, we can then determine the restrictions. Here we can do that by inspection. Remember, the restrictions are the values that evaluate to zero in the denominator. Here we can see five plus negative five is zero. So negative five is a restriction. Here we can see five minus five is zero. And therefore, positive five is a restriction as well. So the two restrictions are plus or minus five. Once we make note of the restrictions, we can then cancel. Here I notice we have opposite binomial factors. We can cancel if we first factor out negative one. Factoring out a negative one will leave us with x minus five. Now we can see x minus five cancels. Here we write the factor negative one in front of the fraction bar and we're left with 2x plus 3 in the numerator and 5 plus x in the denominator. Now that's not what we see in the textbook. In the textbook, the denominator is presented as x plus 5. Now remember, addition is commutative, so that's equivalent. So the original rational expression simplifies to this as long as we keep in mind the restrictions x is not allowed to be plus or minus 5.